Alice Lurian and I have a new spooky box to open for y'all today. This one is box 54 and it's called Let's Get Lost. And the sticker art has a girl with a suitcase behind her. So I'm hoping and expecting that it'll be travel related stuff, which I am super, super stoked for. I am such a perpetual wanderlust in day-to-day -day life. I don't always get to travel a lot, but I absolutely love traveling and going out of town, packing my suitcase. It's something that I've always loved a lot. Let's jump right into it. There we go. Whoa. I blocked my face so I can't see anything. All right, there's packaging of some sort, but I really can't make out much from the monitor here. So let's turn it around and we'll see what we got. It looks like luggagey type stuff. There's a couple of bigger items in here that are folded. And if I unfold it, there's another smaller item on top. I hate how constant the sound of the rustling packaging is. This first smaller item, which is still in the plastic, but I want to show you guys the label because it's really cute. There's one. <laughs> it's a coffin shaped sunglasses case. Oh, and it's got a little moon embossed on the front. And it's got a little snap and it's plain on the back with a little Spooky Box Company tag. It was upside down. There you go, now you can read it. And it feels like some sort of a suede lining on the inside. It's gray on the inside. That's really nice. I do have a couple of pairs of sunglasses that I wear more than most of the others. One is a more like dramatic sort of Hollywood shape with like silver studding. And then I have a pair of round ones. I have the uh, Norse rune on the rims. This would be perfect for those, especially the rune ones. Those are, those are my witchy glasses, is the rune glasses. But yeah, sunglass case. I'm so into it. All right, so now, there's a couple of things here that I think are packing cubes, which I actually just got a set last year, I wanna say, from my friend Holly. These seem cute because they're like purple and black and they've got little spoopy prints on them. Let me pull them out the packaging and then we can look at them more because you can see there's two here. They have different designs on them. So there's actually a third smaller one in there, but I'll get to that one in a second. So these seem about the same size. They feel like a fairly sturdy vinyl on the outside. You can see this one is purple and it's got ghosts and bats on it. And it's got a mesh top. So it's got a double zipper running all the way around the perimeter of the top of it. The inside is solid black vinyl. There's no little pockets on the inside, but the top mesh does seem fairly thick. It's not so thin that things are easily gonna get like in and out of it. It's like a, a double layer mesh. So that way the clothes can like breathe and they won't smell bad. But I am that person that puts a dryer sheet in her luggage to help her stuff smell better. So um, I might have to start putting like a little dryer sheet in each packing cube. That'd be interesting. I'm sorry, someone texted me. And then this is the second one. This one is black in color and it's got spiders, spider webs, and little purple polka dots all over it. And it seems about the same size as the other one. Oh, there's actually a handle on the back. Oh, that's neat. I didn't notice this earlier, but there's a little um, handle along the back portion of the packing cubes, which is nice. The lining on this one is purple, so they just switched the color scheme, which I kind of like. Those are very nice. Vinyl being a more like kind of, this isn't the right term for it, but being a, well, this is the better term for it. I was gonna say slippy, but that's not a good term. Vinyl being a more slick material is easier to clean. So if somehow something were to spill, it's easier to wipe it down and like get that out and avoid a stain. There's a third one that looks smaller. So I'm gonna take this out of the plastic. This one is the same purple as the first big packing cube, but it actually has a different design. This small one has moons and coffins and black polka dots. This is awesome. So I'm probably going to find a way to fold and stuff these all within each other um, just to keep them together. And those will get stored in my suitcase when I'm not traveling. Uh -huh. Here's our pin for this box. And it is a broomstick that you could use to fly away on your travels. I, of course, am a fan of all things witchy and I love the broomstick. And this one being a longer one, they did put two pin spots on it instead of just one. So once you got it attached to whatever you put it on, it's not going to constantly swivel around on you. It's gonna stay put, 
which I love. So I'm gonna pop that there. Here's our candy for the box. <laughs> These are gumballs. They're called Terror Eyes. They're liquid-filled gumballs that look like eyeballs and are apparently strawberry flavored. Here is our patch. It's a little ghost. And it says, time to fly. Little ghosty. What a cutie. Thank you card as usual, the list, which I will get to in a moment. And the very last thing is a pair of postcards. It's a little wish you were here postcard. So it's a beach scene with some tropical flowers and a beach ball and some palm trees. But it's at night, so the sky's purple. The moon and the stars are out. There's some bats going through the sky. And in the water, right offshore, in a black floaty with bat wings and a bat face, is a skeleton drinking something out of a coconut. And it's just, it is such an adorable design. Those are really cool. So yeah, I guessed right. All travel related stuff. Everything is custom made minus the candy, as is the usual. And time to fly ghosty. They actually wrote ghosty on the paper. That just makes my heart happy. This was super cool. I cannot wait to put these to use the next time I go anywhere. I'm very happy. I cannot wait for the next box. Thank y'all so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed the video. Let me know in the comments which item was your favorite and I shall be seeing you all again very, very soon. Keep aiming, loves. I love it.